Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ankush and in our today's video, I will not discuss anything about the technical things, but it is something where I will just try to explain you about the experience which I got it from the multiple MNC. So most of the time I'm getting the mails from the fresher and they are asking me that uh, how to become a DBA, how to become a Oracle DBA. Or it is not about Oracle DBA only, you can talk about any DBA uh, with respect to the different kind of databases we are having. So if you want to start your career as a DBA, there are three technologies that you should know. So if you know these three technologies, then you can be a good DBA. Again, uh, with respect to the experience, again, you will understand new, new things and it will be added value to your experience as well. So I will just try to uh, tell you about what are all those three technologies that will help you to become a DBA. So the first thing is here about SQL. As you know that our Oracle is a RDBMS database which is always running on the SQL queries. SQL, if you have the basic knowledge about the SQL, then again, it is always uh, added value for you to become a DBA. Now, if you want to start your career as a Oracle DBA, you don't need to go with the basic part as you know about the SQL. And if you want to create the table, alter the table, same SQL you can use in your Oracle as well as in MySQL database or SQL Server database. Only the small, small changes you will find. So better if you have the good understanding about the SQL, how the structure goes, how you to create the table, how to insert the data, how to give you the privileges. So these are all things if you have the basic idea, then again, it is always an advantage for you to become a DBA. Next thing is about the Unix operating system. Now what is happening here, if you want to become a DBA, again your most of the Oracle database will be on the top of Unix operating system only. Now Unix and Windows, these are the two different different operating system. In Windows you will find most of the things can be done with the help of GUI only. But in Unix what is happening here, if you want to see the directories again you need to fire the command. Now if you want to become the DBA again, if you have the knowledge about the Unix that is also a good advantage. Now how, how is the structure here? Now we have uh, Oracle server here, Oracle server and on the top of this server you, we can have a multiple databases. Now most of the time you will find this Oracle server is of Unix operating system which is a command line interface. Now if you have the understanding about a Unix, it is always good for you to become a Oracle DBA and within a short time you can try to understand, you will try to get the knowledge about Oracle DBA. And the first thing is SQL, Unix and the third one which is really important is about any programming language. Programming language. If you have done your engineering or BC or MCA from any organization, you will find uh, you will find the course which is having C or C++ language. And nowadays again they are coming with different technology as well. Why they are coming, why they have the education system like this? Because the people know what they want into the IT industry while you are working as a, into the IT industry. So, if you have the knowledge about C or C++ or any programming language, then it can be helpful for you to become a good DBA. Now, why, uh, why these things are correlated to each other? In Oracle DBA, we are creating our shell, shell script, which are mainly useful to, you know, automate your daily routine jobs. Let's say talk about RMN jobs, your export import, or uh, the daily, jo uh, daily things uh, which are coming to your uh, Oracle DBA routine. So if you know about any programming language you can use the same logic in your shell script and again it will be is a plus advantage for you with compared to the other DBA as well. 
Now, if you know about SQL, Unix or programming language, you can become a good DBA. That is a good advantage for you. This is especially for the freshers. Again, when you are increasing your experience, you will get new issues. You will get the new solutions for that issue. You will understand the logic. You will get the logic again and you can be a good DBA. I hope this is pretty much clear and you are enjoying this video. Please do like, subscribe and share this channel so that the freshers can get the good uh, understanding about the Oracle DBA. If you want and you are looking for Oracle training, you can come back to me. Thank you so much for watching this video. See you again with the next video. Please do not forget to subscribe to the channel. Bye bye.